The passenger pigeon Ectopistes migratorius was a bird species native to North America. It was about 16 inches in length with a wingspan of 24 inches. The males had a slate blue upper body, a wine red chest, and bright red eyes, while females were more muted in color with a brownish hue. The passenger pigeon's closest living relative is the mourning dove. Fossil records suggest that the passenger pigeon diverged from its relatives around 1 million years ago. Over time, the species adapted to exploit the vast forests of North America. Passenger pigeons were known for their massive flock sizes, sometimes numbering in the billions. These flocks were so dense and vast that they could darken the sky for hours or even days. They were highly social birds, often roosting and nesting together in large colonies. Their primary diet consisted of mass nuts and seeds from oak and beech trees. They also consumed fruits, berries, and insects. Their feeding habits played a significant role. In the ecology of North American forests, aiding in seed dispersal, passenger pigeons nested in large colonies, often in the same trees. A single egg was laid per nesting attempt, and both parents took turns incubating it. The chicks, once hatched, were fed a secretion known as pigeon's milk by both parents. Indigenous peoples of North America had a long history of hunting passenger pigeons for food. With the arrival of European settlers, the birds became a popular source of cheap meat and were hunted on an industrial scale. The primary cause of the passenger pigeon's extinction was overhunting. Advances in firearms and the expansion of the railroad made it easier to hunt and transport the birds in large numbers. Additionally, deforestation destroyed their habitats and nesting grounds. Despite their once vast numbers, the last known passenger pigeon, named Martha, died in the Cincinnati Zoo in 1914.